you can walk into a beautiful home that has beautiful carpets and furniture and everything's wonderful, but you'll immediately notice if there's nothing on the walls because the walls actually complete the interior decor. Okay, so for example, if you had a home with beautiful paintings, everything was perfect, and I came along and I took everything off the wall, okay, all of a sudden the house would look very, very strange and, and something's really missing and not finished. So paintings, be they small or big, complement and complete the decor of a of a beautiful home so they're very important and also you know with religious work again when I say religious I don't mean necessarily uh, specifically biblical but just something spiritual um, it's important because the children invariably will ask you know who who, who for example I do portraits also uh, of let's say uh, special holy men you know, in, 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 in our tradition. So the children invariably will ask, you know, what's this picture, who is this man, or what's this painting, what's the story behind? And so it enables a, a, a home to have a lot of um, holiness in it. And it enables the children who are growing up and being raised in that home to be in an environment which is special. So I think that, uh, you know, the paintings and the visuals are serving you know multi-purposes and uh, you know it's very refreshing sometimes to come into a home with beautiful paintings you know and you can just sit and relax I mean the very famous very very wealthy personalities that had uh, wonderful collections of very important art and they would come home after a tremendously hard day of work and they would just sit in their favorite you know leather armchair and, and light a cigar and pour themselves a brandy and then they would sit in front of their favorite painting that evening and maybe not speak for an hour or two and feel relieved and so much better afterwards you know so you know there's many people like that in the world you know not everybody sits in front of a television and has to watch you know movies and be entertained they just want to go into that very quiet place that a painting brings them to, if it's a special painting, you know, and hopefully some of mine are. That's, that's you know, that's what I strive for.